Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you 10 lighting ideas and how to build them. All of these I like and I use in my builds. As you can see I'm just quickly showing you what designs I have. This is only a small list of them but we will extend the list soon. So first, let's start with um, this, which is um, a normal street light you'd expect in the city, but it's one I'd expect in a dual carriageway. So let me take out the items. I haven't told you how many items you'll need, only because you can make as many of these as you want. But now in front of it let's build over here one two three four blocks up that's how high you want to go then you want to place a block of smooth stone then two smooth stone slabs on top and two smooth stone slabs on the sides like this then you want to place one smooth stone slab on either side on the next to the top one of these and then you want to just add two sea lanterns on the side i just want to quickly tell you as well that these designs are not intended for survival minecraft although some of them can be made using glitches next we have the single version which i'd expect on just any normal street you will now I'll build it so four up like that one place a smooth stone block on top two smooth stone slabs then you want to place two smooth stone slabs in between one on the top one again and just a sea lantern like that um that comes out really nicely you can see same materials so you won't need to worry about having the wrong materials because they're the exact same design i mean you can make them how you want it's up to you to be honest next we have these two medieval style designs these are 100 percent not made for survival minecraft as they both involve lodestones which are cost like one neverite ingot and i don't expect you to be able to afford it and so i'll just quickly teach you the design so over here you'll want to go place your block of polished deep slave there place four blocks up with cobblestone stairs I mean, sorry, stairs, wall, then you want to place the lodestone, then, like this, the grindstone, then you want to place a chain while shifting, and you want to add the lantern, and the other design, which I will quickly show you, you, what you do is, again, exactly the same, as I'll quickly demonstrate here exact same method but all you want to do is just add on a soul lantern instead of your um normal lantern so next up i'm just going to be throwing all these away don't worry it won't matter have them those these one next up you have this lamp this is a hundred only make this in survival if you if you are willing to use an, a dragon egg glitch to get it but you get whatever table wherever you like just have this and just here just place whatever your table is 
and remember to shift while doing this and possibly go up like this so that I like to do and it's very simple so you just get spruce block dragon egg and quarter pillar of course you can change this as an example I'll quickly change get some light blue concrete and you can literally change it to whatever you want I mean I personally like quartz pillars because it just gives that lamp effect but anyway it's all up to you I'm just going to destroy these chests next up we have a campfire now of course this ground you don't need to make I've made it just for effect literally all you do place down your campfire like that simple and rather design you just use a soul campfire instead they're both very simple I'm sure you can do it if you want to know what blocks I've used here I've used Podzol and Corsta to make the nice texture but anyway on to the next one which again is a bit expensive this is another campfire design um, but it involves so instead you add this you what you do is if I copy this over you dig a hole into the ground get coarse dirt or any sort of dirt place your campfire it can be any type and place your choice of fence over here I'm using spruce and then place a respawn anchor and it makes the cauldron effect but even better I'll make sure not to blow it up but it, it's quite cool to add in one bit of glowstone just because you get the effect that you're actually cooking something in there and it gives off these particles which is really nice of course don't fill it up unless you're in the nether I'm going to leave it there and maybe blow it up for fun other design just use regular campfire of course and final design um the final design is this which is literally just candles get some flint and steel light them up and that's all good so anyway thank you for watching be sure to like and subscribe and I will probably see you in the next one. Anyway everyone, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. So, thank you.